It's been a little while since I've sat in front of this camera. Sorry about that. We took a little break, an actual vacation. So let's not waste any time. Let's dive in this week, today, and let's take on something that'll help us uh, illuminate 2022. Yeah, let's build a light switch cover. That's coming up. What's up, you awesome geeks? I'm Ryan, and welcome to the Smuggler's Room. This week, this chubby geek needs, um, well, we, we need an easy win. We need a way to jumpstart 2022 and get on the right path. You see, we have a lot of projects this year planned. Some of these are massive. And I want something right out of the gate that I can get my arms around, that I can complete in a short period of time and help set up an easy win. So that's what we're gonna do. So let's get to work. You know, when I set out on a large project, I find that I immediately get overwhelmed. It's inevitable that I'll panic a little and wonder just what I've gotten myself into. Take the sci-fi Airbnb spaceship that we're beginning to work on. Or better yet, let's talk about one of your projects. Maybe you decided this year that you're gonna build your own custom room. Where do you start? Just saying it out loud might cause you a bit of stress or even make you doubt it. So what I say is start with something small. Start with something that you can wrap your arms around or maybe that you can even finish in a single day or a weekend. That's what I'm doing this week. I wanted to take on a project that I could quickly finish. Something as simple as a light switch cover made the most sense to me. It's something I can put in a room build or a spaceship Airbnb, and it'll get used every day. It's also a small project that I can see a beginning, middle, and end. I think these small type of projects are good for the making soul. It gives you a chance to get your hands dirty, but not become completely overwhelmed. To me, that's what today's all about. I'm working on something small for a large project. It's my first run at it, and there might be multiple attempts to get it right. But for now, this is an achievable win in a short period of time. You see, it's Saturday and I'm out in the shop. I'm in a place that I love, doing things that I love, and that makes me happy. This year, we want to do the same for you. We've had a fair amount of time off lately. Took a full vacation away from it all for the first time in a long time. During this absence, I've spent a lot of time thinking about what we do in the smugglers room. I've asked myself, where did it start? 
what were our goals? And more importantly, has that changed? Now, I don't mean to get all philosophical on you here. This is, after all, a channel where geeks build geeky things. I mean, that can't be something you sit around and wax poetic about, right? Or can it be? You see, for us, it's not just about building a super nerd basement inspired by the films that I'm obsessed with. It's not about building droids, costumes, props, miniatures, or any of those things. It's actually about how what we do influences you. We love making and building so much that we want to see each of you doing it too. There have been messages sent to us from so many of you sharing stories about your first project, that you're building things in the garage with your kids, that you're spending time with your spouse building something out of nothing. If we're having any impact on any of this, then it's worth it for us to keep going. We'll keep coming up with silly projects made with random junk. We'll share as much useless knowledge about Greeblies that you can stomach. We'll build a spaceship that you and your family can stay in for a weekend. We'll work on our never ending room build, create a tiny miniature world in a display cabinet, and we may even finish the gonk droid. We'll do all of that because of you, my friends. However, we have one condition. We want you to create something. Build something out of foam, construct something out of wood, bake a cake and sculpt it to look like something from your imagination. Write a short story, write a poem, create some music. Do something this year that's totally creative. In fact, do something this year you never thought you could. Try something that scares you, fail at it, and then try again. I guess what I'm saying is, this year, we want you to build something out of nothing.